In today's world, it is crucial that we focus on the good that is going on all around us. And there are many great organizations and people that are stepping out and making a difference, even in our own community. And today we are located at 421 Howell Street at the Redeemer's Inn. And the Redeemer's Inn is a transitional house for the women that are coming out of Fountain Correctional Facility. And I am joined today by Jesse and Beth Lewis. And in conjunction with Church on the Rise, they are the ones who are basically launching out with this project. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank you. So first off, tell us, how did this whole thing come into fruition? Well, about 10 years ago, some ladies that were volunteering at Fountain saw the need for a place, a safe place for women getting out that didn't have a healthy environment to go back to, for them to get a fresh start. Mm -hmm. And they tried to launch it then, but it never quite got off the ground due to some financial things. But now the time is right, and it is getting off the ground. And Redeemer's Inn will be a place for ladies who don't have a family to go home to or a safe place to go home to, but really want to change their life. And I know that you know you need a lot of volunteers, and I, and I know you're heading up the volunteers for this project, Jesse, and I see that you have some some young people behind us tell us a little bit about that right we um, have actually been working on renovating the house the house was donated to us mm -hmm. and so we're we've been working on renovating the house since March but it's all volunteer labor um, we have people from obviously from Church on the Rise coming out but it's a community effort we have people from other churches coming to help uh, people from uh, uh, Faith Christian School are out today helping us which is, is really good Oh, so that's great so they're doing it sort of I, I like they're offering service hours for right, the kids? community service kind of that thing. That is yeah. wonderful. So we're all okay. kind of working on it together. Sure. And we'll have anywhere from 15 to 40 volunteers out on a given Saturday. One of the most important things, and you've been praying about this for a long time, is having the right person come in as a house mother. Tell us a little bit about that. If we're looking for the right person, we believe that God has that person, a woman um, or a couple possibly, that really has a heart for this ministry, that has a heart for women, wants to see women succeed in life, wants to disciple women, and can be a person that lives in the house and manages it on a day-to-day -day basis. And we believe the right person, person is out there. So It's just a matter of finding her. That's right. So we hope that someone is out there maybe watching the show or knows somebody that would say that has been their dream is to disciple and care for and make a difference in ladies' lives. So if you'd like to get involved in this great ministry opportunity and volunteer, or if you or anyone you know is interested in the house mom position, visit our website at www.breakawaytheshow.com. We'll be right back.